valid palindrome to given a string s. Return true if s can be a palindrome after deleting at most one character from it. Note, a palindrome is a string read the same forward and backwards. In this case, the string is already a palindrome, so we return true. Consider this new example. If we delete b, for example, then the string is the same forward and backwards, so we return true. Note, we could have chosen to delete c instead of b, and it still would have been a palindrome. And finally, consider this example. There is no character we could delete to make the string a palindrome, so we return false. We will solve this in O of n time. Consider this new example. We will have two pointers left and right at the start and end of the string. If the characters at the pointers are equal, then we advance the L pointer and decrement the R pointer. Now if the characters at L and R are not equal, then we can choose to delete at most one of them either the left one or the right one. So like I said, we can choose to delete the left one by advancing the left pointer by one, or we can choose to delete the right one by decrementing the right pointer by one. Now let's continue the algorithm in each of the individual cases. Note, in the second case, the characters at the L and R pointer do not equal, and since we could only delete at most one character, in this case, we return false. Now consider the first case where the characters at the L and R pointers are equal. In this case, we continue the algorithm and advance L by 1 and decrement R by 1. When L and R cross each other, we stop the algorithm and we return true. If either or of these cases returns true, then overall we return true. And here's the code to do so. Please like and follow for more.